Friends, Mitty Man, coming back at you from Walker's Music with yet another word for the day. We like to say that we give God the praise, give Him all the glory and the honor. Life, health, and strength for us, whether it is, people, could have been the other way. Also, we want to give a big shout out to the YouTube fam, Baby Justice, all the way up to Big Papa JT. Where is Mama JT? Y'all already know the routine. We love you, and you ain't nothing you can do about it. Also, to the end time harvest, uh, harvest game, Brother LA, Kingdom Knowledge. Elder Michael McCray, Elect Sister 777, Brother PP Drawing, Brother Hot and Clear, Brother JT, Papa JT, Little Brother Orange Flavor, Linda and Leonard, we give y'all honor today as well. We just want to say, people, that uh, it's all about, and still is, about kingdom building. It's all about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And as more and more as we venture toward the end of this year, and uh, we've seen a lot of things that already has happened. Uh, we see a lot of things that are fulfilling Bible prophecy. And uh, I just tell everybody, be ready. In other words, we have this old song that you sang in the Baptist Church, be ready when he comes. In, uh, in other words, we know that our Savior is on the horizon. Now, we don't know when, don't know where we will be. But we know that there's going to be a day of gathering. And when that first trumpet shall sound, in other words, we are uh, we, we 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 give God, we we can we can trust God's word. In other words, I was, like our uh, brother Creflo Dollar, he's uh, doing a, a series on the spirit, soul, and body, trying to get us to understand and get everyone to understand how those three work, and that we live to the spirit, and we will not fulfill the lust of the flesh. For our spirit is the only part of our being that is fully like Jesus. The soul and the body now, we got to work on that. But uh, but the spirit is already equipped. And we just have to learn how to access everything we need. God is already deposited in us according to the word. But the only way we know how our spirit looks is through the word of God, people. And uh, that's what uh, Creflo was teaching in, in this series. But I wanted to say uh, to to the to the whole YouTube gang and end time harvest gang as well as to whomever that might see these videos or whatnot, I want you to say that we are we are fast approaching uh, what we call Resurrection Sunday. In other words, the Jewish New Year. In other words, when they left Egypt the night before they had the Passover, and that next day was their New Year, that began their New Year. In other words people with the Christian faith is deeply rooted in Judaism. As a matter of fact, in my opinion, this is just my opinion, I would say that Christianity was born out of Judaism. Now, I'm not going to try to make teach a whole uh, I'm not going to try to teach anything on Judaism. But I'm going to let you do that on your own. But the Judaism is, quote unquote, the religion of the Jews. Orthodox Jews. You got Messianic Jews. I always wear the Orthodox Jews. And uh, now I know Messianic, y'all. Everybody should know that mes that that word mes Messiah. But now, the reason why I say that if Jesus did not rise from the dead, people, our faith is in vain. <laughs> Everybody. I mean, I, I don't care what 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 faction or what base that you are on. If, if Jesus is, didn't rise from the dead, then our faith is in vain. So therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. He is a new creature. So therefore, that's how come I say we need to just be about our Father's business. And we must get into the Word of God to uh, understand, to see our, the Spirit. And it gives us the reflection. The only way we can know the only way we know how our spirit is, is through the word. The word, the spirit believes the word automatically. We must get ourselves and discipline ourselves, people, to believe and study the word and make our soul, which is our mind, be renewed to the word of God. And therefore, we will feed the spirit more than we feed this old body. We are supposed to be led by the spirit. Now, we can be led by our physical senses in the body. 
But if you be led by the body, you headed for a wreck. So therefore, yeah, if you let the spirit lead, you'll be fine. Because the spirit looks just like Jesus. We are full. We got the fullness of it already, people. Don't let nobody tell you you got a partial. No, you got a partial of nothing. Get in the word. We have the fullness of grace right now. In our spirit, though. The body, no, no, no. Not yet. We got to work on that. We got to work on the spirit. The, I mean, we got to work on the soul and the, the body to make it conform to the spirit. That's what we got to do. So with that being said, I just want to say that uh, we just we're giving God the glory, and I'm hoping that everybody just keep that in mind. And remember, we are work in progress, people. We are work in progress. We none of us made it yet, so don't let us get too puffed up. But let us do everything for all things for the glory of God. And I want to commend our brother Steel Horse. I saw the video and awesome, man. Awesome. Faith without work is dead. Jesus said you're known by the fruit. And I said that act of kindness, brother. That shows what we're all about. See, anybody can talk it. But I'm telling you, if anybody haven't seen that video that Brother Steel Horse put up, Steel Horse 45, I think it is, check it out. Check it out. That is what we all are supposed to be doing. Find somebody. Find somebody to help. Don't just sit back and just, you know, want everything to be done for you all the time. Find someone that you can help. Find someone in need. Help the poor. Believe it. God loves and he will bless those that. When you help the poor, you just like signing up your certificate to get blessed by God when you help the poor and those that cannot help themselves. That's scripture, people. That is Bible. So with that being said, many men are going to cut it off right here and going to say whatever you get or whatever you get into. If God is not in it, remember I told you, get out of it. This is Midi Man saying peace. Goodbye.